Welcome to the Travel and Luxury channel, please subscribe to get updated on all future videos, thank you. Ever wondered what are the top things to do in Oxford, England? An illustrious city that's more than just a globally renowned academic powerhouse, Oxford is steeped in rich history and brimming with charm. From its prestigious university that has shaped minds for centuries, to its stunning architecture that whispers tales of yesteryears, Oxford promises a plethora of experiences. Each corner of this city holds a story waiting to be discovered. Join us as we count down the top 10 things to do in the city of dreaming spires. Starting at number 10, we have the world-renowned Oxford University. This prestigious institution is steeped in history, tracing its origins back to the 11th century. It's the oldest university in the English-speaking world, and it has been shaping minds and influencing global society for over nine centuries. Oxford University is not just a place of learning but a symbol of knowledge and excellence, a beacon that has attracted some of the finest minds from around the globe. Its alumni include influential figures such as the legendary physicist Stephen Hawking, the timeless writer Oscar Wilde, and even several British prime ministers. Walking the hallowed halls of Oxford University, you are treading the same paths as these luminaries, soaking in the atmosphere of a place where countless ideas have been nurtured and grown. A visit to Oxford wouldn't be complete without stepping foot in one of the world's most prestigious educational institutions. At number 9, don't miss the opportunity to visit the historic covered market. This bustling hub of commerce nestled in the heart of Oxford is a treasure trove of unique finds. Here you'll discover a myriad of shops, each with its own distinctive charm. From artisan bakeries wafting the tempting scent of freshly baked bread, to quirky boutiques filled with one-of-a-kind gifts, the covered market is a shopper's paradise. But the allure of this place extends beyond retail therapy. The covered market also boasts a smorgasbord of food stalls featuring everything from delectable local produce to exotic international cuisine. Picture this, one moment you're biting into a crunchy locally grown apple, and the next, you're savoring sushi rolls prepared by skilled chefs right before your eyes. Whether you're a foodie or a shopper, the covered market has something for everyone. So be sure to pay a visit and immerse yourself in this vibrant sensory feast. Coming in at number 8, take a leisurely stroll in University Parks. This 70 acres of well-manicured land is a green oasis amidst the hustle and bustle of Oxford City Center. The park is not just a visual treat, but also a hub for various activities that you can indulge in. For those who love the outdoors, University Parks offers a multitude of sports facilities. Cricket, rugby, tennis, you name it, it's all there for you to enjoy. If you're more of a laid-back visitor you can always pack a picnic and enjoy a peaceful afternoon under the shade of the park's grand old trees. And for bird watchers, well, you're in for a treat. The park is home to a multitude of bird species, offering a delightful spectacle for any nature enthusiast. So if you're looking to swap the stone walls and spires of Oxford for lush green and chirping birds, University Parks is your perfect escape. For a breath of fresh air and a break from the city buzz, University Parks is the place to be. Number 7 on our list takes us to the Ashmolean Museum. This isn't just any museum, it's the world's first university museum, a fact that speaks volumes of its rich lineage. Nestled in the heart of Oxford, the Ashmolean Museum is a magnificent amalgamation of history, culture, and art. It houses a vast array of collections that span continents and millennia. From the ancient world to the modern times, the Ashmolean's diverse collections are an ode to human creativity. Its exhibitions, which range from Egyptian mummies to contemporary art, offer a unique glimpse into the evolution of civilizations. And let's not forget the art, oh the art. With masterpieces from the likes of Picasso, Michelangelo and Turner, the museum is a paradise for art lovers. But the Ashmolean is more than just a museum. It's a journey through time, a voyage of discovery, a treasure trove of art and archaeology. The Ashmolean Museum is a must-visit for history buffs. At number 6 experience the thrill of live theater at the Oxford Playhouse. This iconic theater, nestled in the heart of Oxford, is a hive of artistic activity. Here, you will find a diverse range of performances that cater to all tastes and interests. For those who appreciate the classics, the Playhouse frequently stages productions of Shakespeare, Chekhov, and other literary giants. If you have a taste for the contemporary, you'll find an array of modern plays, musicals, and even opera gracing the stage. And let's not forget the children, the Oxford Playhouse is also known for its fantastic family-friendly shows and pantomimes, but the Playhouse is more than just a venue. It's a community, 
With its workshops, talks, and post-show discussions, it offers a unique opportunity to immerse yourself in the world of theater, to learn, to participate, and to be entertained. From drama to comedy, the Oxford Playhouse offers a cultural feast for theater lovers. Halfway through our list at number 5, we have the Bodleian Library. This isn't just any library, my friends, this is one of the oldest libraries in all of Europe. It first opened its doors to knowledge seekers in the year 1600, making it a site of historic significance. This library is an emblem of Oxford's rich academic tradition. It houses an incredible collection of over 12 million printed items. From ancient manuscripts to modern novels, the library's extensive collection spans across centuries and continents. Beyond the books, the Bodleian Library is also an architectural marvel. The intricate design and the grandeur of the library is a testament to the importance Oxford places on learning and knowledge. Every nook and cranny of this place whispers tales of the past, making it a living breathing part of history. With its stunning architecture and vast collection of books, the Bodleian Library is a paradise for book lovers. At number 4, enjoy a traditional Oxford activity, punting along the River Cherwell. Punting, for those who don't know, is all about propelling a flat-bottomed boat in a rather unique way. You stand on the rear deck with a long pole, pushing against the riverbed. It's a test of balance and finesse, and it's certainly a laugh when you first try it. But don't worry, you'll get the hang of it in no time. This isn't just about the fun of learning a new skill though. As you glide along the tranquil waters of the River Cherwell, you'll be treated to some of the most stunning views Oxford has to offer. Towering trees, picturesque meadows, and architectural gems from centuries past, all seen from a unique perspective on the water. And the best part? It's an experience available all year round. So no matter when you visit, you can get a taste of this quintessential Oxford tradition. For a truly Oxford experience, you can't miss out on punting. At number three, step into the hallowed halls of Christ Church. This magnificent institution is not just one of the largest colleges of Oxford University, but it's also a pivotal part of Oxford's skyline thanks to its grand bell tower. It's a place where history and tradition blend seamlessly with the present. Founded in the 16th century by King Henry VIII, Christ Church has been a cornerstone of academic excellence for over five centuries. Its alumni list reads like a who's who of notable figures, from philosophers to prime ministers. But Christ Church has another claim to fame that might interest the movie buffs among you. Remember the magical world of Harry Potter? Some scenes were filmed right here in Christ Church's dining hall, which served as an inspiration for Hogwarts Great Hall. So, whether you're a history enthusiast, a Harry Potter fan, or just someone who loves beautiful architecture, Christ Church has something for you. From stunning architecture to Harry Potter connections, Christ Church is a magical place to visit. At number 2, immerse yourself in the fascinating world of the Pitt Rivers Museum. This isn't your everyday museum. It's a treasure trove of anthropology and world archaeology, housing over half a million exhibits from all corners of the globe. Imagine standing face to face with an authentic Hawaiian feather cape or pondering the mysteries of an ancient Egyptian shapti. The museum's collection is so vast it's like stepping into a time capsule, where every object tells a story about human history and culture. From intricately carved totem poles to fascinating shrunken heads, the Pitt Rivers Museum holds a wealth of knowledge waiting to be discovered. Each exhibit offers a unique glimpse into the lives of people from diverse cultures and epics, creating a truly immersive experience. This museum doesn't just display artifacts, it narrates tales of human civilization, making it an unforgettable journey through time and space. For a journey around the world in one building the Pitt Rivers Museum is the place to go. And finally at number one, the best way to experience Oxford is by taking a walking tour. It's a delightful way to truly immerse yourself in the city's vibrant atmosphere, with every step offering a new discovery. Walking tours take you beyond the glossy surface of tourist attractions revealing the real Oxford that's steeped in history and tradition. You'll find yourself strolling along cobbled streets lined with centuries-old buildings, each with its own tale to tell. A knowledgeable guide will be your time-traveling companion, narrating stories of the city's past, pointing out architectural marvels, and sharing fascinating anecdotes about Oxford's famous personalities. Walking tours also offer an intimate perspective of the city, allowing you to engage with its unique rhythm. You can pause to admire the beautiful spires, soak in the scholarly aura of the university, or simply enjoy the charming ambiance of a quaint cafe. For a comprehensive view of Oxford, nothing beats a walking tour. And there you have it, the top 10 things to do in Oxford, England. 
From exploring the centuries-old Oxford University and the eclectic covered market, to taking a serene stroll in university parks. Be sure to visit the Ashmolean Museum, the Oxford Playhouse and the Bodleian Library. Don't miss a punt along the River Cherwell, a visit to Christchurch or the Pitt Rivers Museum. And lastly, take a walking tour of Oxford to truly soak it all in. Whether you're a history enthusiast, a foodie or a nature lover, Oxford has something to offer everyone. Until next time, happy travels.